Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. GameCube and Wii emulation on Android just got a massive improvement. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, Dolphin Emulator, your favorite Wii and GameCube emulator on Android, did get a massive improvement. At the time of filming here, though, it's not available on the Google Play Store version of the emulator. The improved version here is sitting in one of the development builds, so to pick that up, you'll have to go to dolphin-emu.org. When you're here, click on Download, and then once you're here, scroll down to where it says Development Versions. You'll probably want to pick up at least 5.0-15952 or later. Now, interestingly enough here, this performance improvement is simple, weird, and effective, and it has been overlooked for quite some time. The description is as follows. Turning off primitive restart increases performance a lot on Adreno for some reason. We're talking numbers like 50 to 100% faster in situations which are bottlenecked by rendering. Now, just a friendly heads up here, this performance increase is for Adreno devices. So if you have a Snapdragon processor here, you'll probably notice quite a bit of an improvement. If your processor has a Mali GPU, I don't think this will be effective. You can definitely test it out to see if it helps, but I don't think it will. Here's a quick comparison between the Google Play Store version of Dolphin and this brand new Dolphin development build. There is a massive performance difference between the two. They're both running at four times resolution. There is slowdown on both, but the development version picks up very quickly and it actually gets to 30 frames a second. Now, interestingly enough here, Gamer64, the person behind Citra Enhanced and also Dolphin360 noticed these changes in Dolphin MMJ and asked for them to be ported over to the mainline version of Dolphin. And they were. At the end of the day here, I'm pretty sure these improvements will eventually hit the Play Store. I just don't know how long it's going to take. For the time being, the only way to get them is to head to dolphin-emu.org, pick up that development APK, and, well, enjoy. Anyways, that is all I've got for this one. Short, sweet, and to the point. All stuff and no fluff. Let me know your thoughts about these improvements in the comments below. Did they work? Did they not work? Let me know in the comments below. And let me know your thoughts about Dolphin in general. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Thank you everyone, take care.